Right, uh, welcome everybody to yet another episode of Days Gone Survival Mode. And as you can tell, I'm a lot livelier than I was in the last two videos because it's... I'm doing this recording much earlier in the day. It's about 4 o'clock, 4.30. I was doing it like 1am, 2am last time. So, yeah. It was a bit worn out. Didn't eat much either. Much livelier now. And we're on the hunt for some ones. This must be where she comes to get water. A girl. Yeah, you come here for water every day, don't you? If you move cautiously and stick around all of you get the Okay, I mean some of the I was a bit down on uh but I'm impressed by some of these, but some of the tracking sequences are pretty cool. They're okay. You know, he does articulate himself well when he's trying to explain what exactly the signs he's seeing means. Doesn't always do it, I think, but sometimes he does, and it's pretty good. Oh shit. Oh, box. Time to go around. Be all quiet-like. Can make something out of this. <sighs> Smart girl. Stay off the street. Only come out at night. Freakers are out, but she'd be harder to see. You fucking rippers, none of you are getting out of here alive. Get low. Bandages. You can take a lot of damage when in battle. <laughs> really can't. It's survival mode, remember. Uh, take cover to apply bandages Tell and medkits. How much ammo? I should have checked. I got 17 rounds. Eight in the silencer. That's fine. It's not so bad. It's doable. Lost it. She has joined the free. Free. She has joined the free. Headshots galore. Okay, the sniper's gonna be a bitch. Fuck all y'all! This really is like a Walking Dead scenario. Uh, we're having a gun like we're in a gunfight, and there's just zombies everywhere. I reckon that sniper hits me. I'm dead. In Insta death, right there. Get low. Ah, see what I mean? Yeah. Grenade. Oh, that was close, actually. Hey. All right, yeah. When this goes well, it goes well. When it goes bad, it's terrible. Nope, no, no, what are you doing? Get away. There. What did I do? Oh, I know I switched the body, that's fine. Thought I swapped guns. Oh yeah. I'm, I wonder if I can sledgehammer this guy, because he's got a gun. I don't think he's paying that much attention to his surroundings. Much like me in PUBG. So, I reckon I should take him. Bit of scrap always helps. I need scrap. Yeah, you do need scrap. Oh god. Yeah, take that. Um, I mean, I, I doff my cap to you, friend, for taking 
four hits to the cranium from a sledgehammer and to keep going. Yeah, that's, that's impressive. Good. Annoying, but impressive. Was that the last of them? I'm gonna leave my crossbow there, I don't need it. For now, I'd prefer to have the sniper rifle. Nope, that was not the last of them. Did I get to do them? No, I got one. Sniper rifle time. If I still got ammo for it. Oh my god. Um. Hey. Finally, I've come across people in this game who shoot like I do, in that they miss most of their shots. It's encouraging for me. It means I'm not the worst person in this game world. Oh god. Cool. All done. I swear to God that was the last of them. I'm sure. Taking out a small army here. I just see the. I saw the HUD there for a second. Here. All right, kid. How are you? How do I see the HUD? Although from seeing the HUD, I do know that I've got next no health left. So that's good. Don't be afraid. Uh, I'm not gonna hurt you. Are you alone? Is there uh, anyone else with you? Oh man. Okay. 
uh, is, is this your room? It's really great. Uh, are, are these yours? No. So, uh, you That's oh. mine. This one's for gymnastics. I should have won first place, but Missy King, she cheated. Lisa. Lisa, you hear the gunshots outside? It's not safe here. I was now, at we... school. And my mom called me and told me to come home right away and not stop. And they would be here waiting for me and we would leave together. And I got here and there was a note that said they left with some men. And I didn't know what to do. So, so I hid. I, I didn't know what to do. It's all right. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, Lisa, not far from here. There's a camp, and you really ought to let me take you there. Uh, no. There are people there. There are people. I know them. It's. I'm not gonna lie to you. It's a work camp, and to eat you have to work. Life is gonna be hard, no. but at least you ain't gonna starve. No. Uh, no, my mom's coming here is, for okay, me. Okay, is this your mommy? Well, you said she didn't come home, right? So maybe she's at the camp. Mom is at the camp. She is. I know she is. Okay. Stay close. The men with the guns. Are they still out there? No, we don't gotta worry about them. Lots of sick people. <laughs> do I have to take care of these guys? I think I do. Okay, um, let me think. They got eight rounds. Ten machine gun rounds, sledgehammer, and a Molotov. Good odds. Oh yeah, I got attention now. Huh? Come on. They do. What the? Shouldn't be out here. No, I should hit like affect them. Lisa, shit. We should go. Like if I shoot a zombie coming at me, like lunging at me. The the bullet hitting them should at least knock them off balance a little. <laughs> Just bullets, it seems. Alright, grab what I can. Don't think I need that. I'm sure there's a petrol can near the bike. Oh shit. Lisa, stay behind me. Good night. We shouldn't be out here.
Oh, you've got to be shitting me. Oh, of course, that is in the game, isn't it? That's in the main game. Isn't it? Get away, get away, get away. Oh, no, no. Ay, ay, ay. What kills me? That's what kills me. Really? One of them little shits hiding on the roof. That's what does me in. All right, let's. Hopefully, I. Yeah. Okay. Thank God. Revenge. If I can aim the. Whoa! That was a leap. All right. I'm not gonna have revenge. But. Ugh, oh, God, that was something. Alright, get out of the bin. Stop going after the freakers. Get, in the, get out of the bin. Get on the bike. Finally. Yeah, you think? Get on the bike. Stop running at. What are you doing? Get back here! You crazy person. I can't fix this. That'll hold. Fuel can. Nab the fuel. Do I need it? Don't think I need it. Time to burn! Alright, get your butt on the bike. Where am I going? Uh. Hey, what's your name? Uh, Deacon. My name's Deacon. Uh, Lisa, Lisa, how did you live out here alone for all this time? <sighs> you don't talk much, do you? My dad's a rock hound. He used to take me out here looking for thunder eggs. Thunder eggs? Uh, what is that? They're rocks, but... When you cut them open, they're really pretty inside. Okay. That, that sounds great. We used to go all over. Elnap Crater, the Lava Flow, and Black Crater. Everywhere. Do you think he's at the camp, too? Uh, I don't know, kid. Okay, so that was probably one of the better um, outings I've had so far. Didn't die at all, bar the odd, bar the accident Shit. that Someone's I will in the tunnel. not speak what? of again. Here, hop off. Listen to me. The gunshots that you heard, those were really bad men. Do you understand? And as I say that, I'm probably going to die now. We've got nine rounds. Stay here. Find some place to hide. Don't come out until I say so. Okay. Uh, where did they go? They're here. Right, you ah, oh, God. Get him, get him. Down, down. What did I ever do to you? Shit, almost out. Not moving, huh? He's not moving. Get him. Hey, hey. These aren't rippers. So why did it? Ooh, wow. If the bullet didn't kill her, that grenade really did. Boom! I love doing that. I see you running around. He doesn't want to fight. Damn it! Kill him! Kill him! Kill this son of a bitch! 
Lisa? Kid? Come on out, it's safe. Topping off. Okay, scavenge everyone else. Then carry on to the hot springs. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Did I burn the? Oh, I burnt this nest out. This is from the start of the game. I think maybe. I'm not. I'm not too sure. No, it couldn't have been because that tunnel was going to the cemetery. No idea. Come on, hop on. You okay? Yeah. I, I think I want to go home. Nah, kid, the camp. You'll be safe there, you'll see. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna ask you a question, Lisa, and I need you to think real hard. Did any of your neighbors, did they own any firearms? You know, like uh, pistols, rifles, things like that? No. Men came and took everything. Men? Were they like the men in the tunnel, or, or did they wear uniforms like, uh, like in the army? Like the army. But they were really dirty, and they carried flags they made themselves. Um, Deschutes County Militia, I think. I don't remember. Did they have anyone with them? Women? Children? I don't remember. Okay. Tommy would remember. Tommy? Tommy Strickland, my best friend, but he's gone. He left with his dad to hide. Hide? I, I don't... His dad built a fallout shelter and put all kinds of stuff in it. Maps, food, water, guns, you know. Stuff like that. Okay, okay, do you know where that is? No. They wanted me to come with them, but I knew my mom and dad would come back for me. Somebody's at the gate. All right, this is it. We're here, so just stay with me. Open up. Okay. Well, who do we have here? This is Tucker. Oh my God. <gasps> Lisa, honey. Oh, it's okay. You're safe now. Mom and Dad, and everyone got sick, and I didn't know what to do, and men came, and people Shh, got sh sick, and it's okay. You're safe now. It's a miracle. It's a goddamn miracle. We were neighbors, weren't we, Lisa? I lived just down the block. I knew her parents. Are they here, Mrs. Tucker? Honey, you know the answer to that. No. They're not here. Let's go in. Get you cleaned up. Something to eat, and then, then I'll find a place for you to sleep. Take her in. Give her some food. Go see Alkai. I'll update your credits tonight. Hey, hey, listen, listen. She's she's been through a lot. Can we just let me worry about how? No, gonna... listen to me, okay? Seriously, don't work her like you do everyone else. Don't tell me how to run my camp. 
You want to move here? You want to help us run this? Then maybe you get some say. What a bitch. <laughs> Don't get soft on me, Deke. <sighs> what a bitch. Yeah, I don't really like um, this camp too much. So it's just, yeah, you're stuck between in the beginning of the game, this part that I'm in, you're stuck between a forced labor camp and whatever the corporal in the camp is. How you Crazy doing? people. Hey, what's up? What? Uh, what guns we got? What guns do we got? I got a Sap Nine. A noticeable improvement over the nine millimeter, more ammo capacity, and a better outfit. Oh, cool. That's a good one. Uh, thanks for the confirmation. I want that gun, or that one. One of the two. I need to be in the next level, though. I'm about ten thousand two hundred and fifty XP away from the next level, so I got a little ways to go. Just a little. Yeah, all right. If I go I'll to the Kitchen. I'll let know you by. I don't know where any of the places are around you. Um, bounties and stuff are by the main gate, I think. There's the mechanics. Hey, what do you need? Hey, they got nothing. Because this camp's just right. mainly for guns. Hey, hey uh, how's it going? I haven't seen what Boozer around much lately. Yeah, he's around. I guess he's just been doing more work for Copeland lately. <laughs> you tell him I said get off his ass and do some work for me. Yeah, I'll let him know. Whatever. Whatever. Mm. See you again. Yeah. See you, Mercer. All right. Kitchen. Cool, kitchen. We're gonna run short. Sell, yeah, I know what camp kitchen is. is a feed, so five wolves, 15 trust. Yeah, you don't get that much. That's it for now. That some is better than nothing. That's 80, so. It's helped a little bit. We'll fuel the bike and drive to. Where's next? Drive to track deer. Right up. Hey man. Hey, what's going on? Stuff's getting scarce. Yet we use Later. it throughout the game, so not that scarce. Can I help you? Uh, just having a look. Cool, take a left. Springs, yeah, yeah, I know where that is. Hey, Boozer, you there? Yeah, dude. I just caught a break. A hero radio might actually be useful. I know where they're going tomorrow. Wait, I thought you said you couldn't take them on. No, I can't, but with a little luck, I can get to their chapel without being seen and. Give them hell, brother. Remember what Jack used to say? You'll ride faster than your guardian angel can fly. Like I said, Jack used to say a lot of stuff. Um, nah, I'll go with deer hunting and then go for Nero. May as well do what's closest. 
I suppose. Goddamn rippers. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake, really. Across the bridge and into town. Okay, I'm going the right way. Cool. Just a little bit off, like my driving. I keep nicking things in the corners and whatnot. Hopefully, that gets better the more I play. I will not be hitting things repeatedly at the most inopportune of times. So, yeah, while I drive, may as well just talk about some stuff. But lately, I have been reading uh, a Walking Dead book. I started reading a Walking Dead book. Probably why I started playing this, really. And start doing the commentary for it. Thought so I'd do commentary for a change. Because uh, I've already done the main game, like the normal mode, without commentary. So I thought I may as well talk over the survival mode stuff. Um, but yeah, I've been reading the Walking Dead book. I think it's called Descent, I think. Oh, I, d I finished Descent. I mean, Invasion now. It's like a series of ten novels based in Woodbury. Uh, I think it's set in the comic book universe, it's not quite sure. I didn't read the first few, because I already know roughly what happens, because I've read some of the comic. But yeah, the book, first book was alright. On the second now, so I'll uh, see where that goes. Loading times! Woo! So, you want to learn how to hunt? Is that what I'm hearing? I know how to shoot a gun. It's a rifle, not a gun. I was in the 10th Mountain Cope. Don't give me any of Marine Corps bullshit. Killing a buck's freak. The best way to hunt an animal is to track it. You gotta focus. And see what nature's trying to tell you. If you look hard enough, you'll see the signs. I thought he was going to pick up a handful of deer shit or something. Like, yeah, this is a sign. pile of deer scat. It's fresh. Yeah, I see it. They lead this way. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Well, come on, man. Quick, there's your buck. <sighs> I see him. Now here, use my rifle. If you were in the 10th mountain, you know how to use a scope. Yeah, Cope, I know how to use a scope. Do or die time, do or die. Easy, easy. I got this. Wait for him to look up. Got him. 
Nice shot. Track quarry, you have <coughs> unlocked. Track quarry, the ability to track a wounded deer. Look at the blood trail, you can tap R3 to use survival vision. Right, oh, damn it, it wasn't a kill shot. He got away. No, no, that's okay. You wounded him. He'll bleed out soon enough. We just gotta track him. <sighs> okay. <laughs> See, I learned to do this, but as I. If from what I remember, yeah, I never did track quarry ever again throughout the rest of the game. And follow him. On it. And that was with a HUD, so I He'll doubt I'm going to be doing this now. much now. Too much blood. We should be coming across his carcass any time now. Okay. Yeah, look. Cope, Boozer and I have been hunting before. He used to go elk hunting with his old man, and yeah, he uh, he showed me how to gut it deer. Well, let's just say no disrespect to Boozer, but you've got a lot to learn. You're wasting a lot of meat there. Overall, not bad for a beginner. Yeah, thanks. Back to the loading screen, with a loading screen of like t 10 minutes to load up the game. Now, I'll take back that rifle. Here, thanks. Like I said, Deke, we can always use more venison at the camp. Still got some folks trying to heal up from that Ripper attack. Okay, Cope. Yeah, I'll see if I can remember that. Cool. It's a rifle and a gun. He's my brother. Thirty-six. Cope says you've been helping out around the camp. He won't say it, but he appreciates it. What's up, Manny? Hey, hey you take good no. care of her. I mean, ever. Good choice, man. Good choice. Do I have to pay for paint? For yeah, you do. I'll go this for that. This will last you for a while. I'll go for that one. Oh yeah, that's a good piece. And. Anything else? Oh, these, these are just things to put on the. Yeah. Um. Accent paint? No. Yes. Yes? No. Ah, uh, I'm to the. Hmm. It's weird. What happened to all the different skins that I've been unlocking? Is that something else that I have to do, or what? Are they not available to me yet? I'll be here. That's weird. I'll be um, here if you need me. Where's the bike? Deacon, you keeping an eye on that gas tank. The one with the custom paint job you've been asking about. Manny. How's it going, booze man? Supplies. We do some more meat if you get a chance. Shit. Okay. Uh, I guess it's been a while since we did any hunting. I'll see if I can scare up some meat while I'm out. Yeah. Yeah. Give a few pointers, believe it or not. Oh, shit. I don't believe it. Thanks, Dean. See you, Booth Map. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. I grew up in these here woods. My grandfather told me all about her. My father still works in the world he never would have dreamed of. I built my first tree house to use as a deer blind. Getting high from the target helps your aim and keeps you safe. Back then, I took out my first doe from up top. Oh, Today, that was way too high. My camps are shooting trees. You want to survive and can contribute. You come to me. We got 
got you covered. Grandfather also taught me how to catch a doe. Sometimes you gotta lay an ambush. Hide where they need to go. Like a watering hole. Today, you're as likely to be prey as hunter. So you gotta keep your eyes peeled when you're hitting up places we all need to go. My grandfather always said the easiest way to a good meal was to lay a trap. Put a snare by a tree. And you could have dinner next time you come round. But careful. A headless snake can still bite. Especially when it ain't really dead. <laughs> My grandfather would have outlived us all. Let me tell you. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Great! Hope so! You and your granddaddy set traps for him! And you and your old man used to lay down salt licks. That's real sporting. Uh, guess none of that shit matters now. All right, now I just gotta find some meat. What am I doing now? Uh, if I'm going, I'm ah, uh, cool. He confused me there when he said he had to go find meat. I was like, no, I'm going for Nero, aren't I? Okay, I got 10 minutes before I have to probably hit the 50 minute mark, so I might be able to do this. Get it done and dusted by then. Hey, Sarge, how about we make an unscheduled stop? Oh, yeah, he saw me. Stop right there! Ah. Drifter, we will open fire! She saw me. Correction. Bar that, this should go smoothly, if I don't let them see me running around the bushes, like a creep. Would she see me anyway though, I wonder? I am concealed in this. I'm not sure. Yeah, that's right. You take a few steps back. No, don't, don't come into. Don't Stop come. Right oh, ah, yeah, Drifter bitch. Will open fire. To be fair, she should see me a lot easier than that because I do stand out somewhat, and she was really close. So I'm assuming those gas masks do sort of diminish the. Are you sight? The line of sight? Oh, for fuck's sake, you're chasing me. Oh, they see me and I can't run. Ah, oh, yeah. Oh, come on. Yeah, because I haven't got any stamina. Eek. They still didn't see me, did they? They did. Oh, you bitch. <laughs> he saw me all the way. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Walk away. Walk away. Turn around. Yeah, hey, that's right. Now he's coming this way. So I'll just sit here and wait. And then eventually, he might actually get you. I 
That guy has just been wandering around for the last few minutes. Look at the bush, just wandered around. Not really much of a bodyguard, I have to say. Because he just let the scientist, he left the scientist on his own. So we could run away and check out bushes. I don't quite understand why they're wearing the suit still. It's been two years since the outbreak, yet they're still going around in hazmat gear. I mean, I understand the idea behind it, but I also understand that there's no real point behind it. Because it's been two years, so they're bound to be infected to some... Oh, fuck! My men are authorized to shoot on sight! Ah, the hell with you. So if I just run all the way over there... Oh, okay. Yay, checkpoint. I now have to sneak my way through this entire level again. I say sneak. What I'm doing isn't really sneaking. Well, look at this way, you poor son of a bitch. At least you weren't torn apart by freaks. If you lived a few more weeks, you might have become one yourself. And whether that meant something. Stay back. I just want to talk. Uh, Nero Protocol 2-7 states clearly that, that if conducting operations in quarantine zones, that if I encounter any civilians or sub, sub, civilians, that I'm forbidden from making contact. Really? See, that sounded to me like making contact. Yes. Yes, it did. You're alive. Yes. I am. How? How are you alive? What? I, I, I don't understand. Okay. You were there that night. Farewell. The next it's night, with Nero camp, Protocol 2 7 were states. I, Everyone was dead. Two they were slaughtered. Seven. Torn limb Nero, from goddamn limb. Protocol All right, two listen up. We're going to do this the easy way or the hard way. The easy way, we have a little chat. You give me the information that I need, and then you go back to digging your way through freaker shit or whatever the hell else you're doing out here. The hard way. Crack open that little spacesuit, and then we see what your friends out there have to say about you breathing in all this contaminated air. So what's it gonna be, O'Brien? Yes. Okay. Okay. You remember the rooftop of the old brewery? I put a woman on your chopper. She was wounded. Yes. I remember, a, a knife wound. She, she was cut pretty bad. I went to the refugee camp that you said you were taking her to. Everyone was dead, so I'm gonna ask you again. How did you survive? Uh, we weren't there. Uh, we were diverted south to another camp. Uh, like you said, the uh, camp in Belknap was overrun, so they moved us south to a uh, camp outside of Silver Lake. Were there survivors? You mean now? I don't know. I, I was transferred to the research unit. Did she survive? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, 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 I can find out. I, I can check. You, you have one of our radios. That's how you... Uh, I, I can't promise anything, but I'll, I'll check. Uh-huh, and I'm going to go with you. No, Come on. You, you can't. Please, you don't... Hey, don't understand, but fucking shoot you. Not before I shoot you. Okay, look, if you're going to fucking kill me, do it, okay? I did my job. Did that woman, your wife... I put her on oxygen, I gave her an IV. I kept her alive. I got in a lot of trouble for that. She was septic, she wasn't gonna make it, but I got out of the mass unit. I saved her goddamn life! O'Brien, <sighs> report. I have to go. Please, I, you have to get out of here. You don't know these men. You don't know Brian, what they're capable of. If I don't hear from you. I don't care how long it takes, I'm gonna track you down. And I'm gonna do a lot worse than snap off an antenna. I'm sorry about your wife. But you're not the only one who lost someone that night.
you know that comment O'Brien makes about him not being the only one to lose someone? That makes me wonder Brian if uh, he's alive. How the hell is he alive? They were, we're going to put her on oxygen. He gave her an IV. He kept her alive. She was septic, so she wasn't going to make it. But right, it's getting loud now. Hang on. Get her to mesh unit. He saved her life. He said it. He said he saved her life. She, she can still be alive. She, no, 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 no. But O'Brien is alive. If he is. I don't know what that listening icon so. Ooh. Whoa! Oh, fuck you, buddy. Okay, now just gonna carve it up. Why are they shooting at me for? What have I done to them? A few days ago, I asked you if you remembered that Nero asshole, O'Brien. Uh, yeah, Deke, it's, it's all uh, kind of blur. Yeah, yeah, okay. Get some shut eye booze, man. I will tell you about <gasps> Oh, what the hell? Everything's having a go at me today. I just want to hunt. And I clearly am. Yeah, yeah, okay. Get some shut eye booze, man. I will tell you about it later. When are we riding out of here, Deke? Oh, soon, Boozer. Real soon. I do want... <clears throat> no idea what as that... As soon as your arm heals, we're gonna be riding the hell out of here. Yeah, Deke. Okay. Yeah, I have no idea what that listening prompt is for, but whatever. But yeah, I mean, I do wonder if we're going to be treated to a DLC about O'Brien. O'Brien. <laughs> Random and... Weird, I know. There, but O'Brien. That would be interesting, because that comment does make me wonder if they put like a backstory to his character. Oh, you son of a bitch! You better radio me. You hear me, O'Brien? I know you're on this channel. God damn it! Okay. And I quite like to, to me, know more about him. To track you down. You got that? I do find it. I find damn it curious. Come on, O'Brien! Right. Back to me. Beacon, shut the fuck up. Yeah, I do find it a bit curious that you don't see his face. You can see his face in the beginning, in the intro. But yeah, don't see his face again for the rest of the game. Deke, you there? Did you track down the chopper? Was it the same guy, the one we saw on the roof that night? Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, it, it was him. Do you remember this? Sarah, what happened? I don't know. They got diverted south. He, he remembered her, but he doesn't know what happened to her. Oh! Oh, I didn't think that landed near me. She didn't throw it anywhere in my direction. She didn't look like she was throwing it in my direction. Anyway, I've just hit the 55 minute mark, so that's the end of this video. Thank you all for watching. As I say always, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Oh, Brian, oh, he's alive. How the hell? It's easier if I just pause it. Uh, let me know what you think of the uh, commentary and the walkthrough so far. Put it down in the comments. I'll uh, thank you very much for any feedback you want to give me. Uh, I'll try and talk a bit more about other things as well when I'm like driving around and just doing stuff like the books I'm reading and some other stuff, you know, uh, just to fill in the gaps where nothing's really happening. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. And remember, to, if you can be so uh, generous as to share the video and try and get some other people to see it, to leave comments below and feedback and so on. And remember to subscribe to keep up to date with the, the walkthrough. I'll try and release it daily. Uh, if not, it'll be weekly. Well, I say weekly, weekdays. Um, that's about it, really. Thank you all for watching and enjoy the rest of your day.